Hi everyone, I'm going to show you the end-to-end -end settings of the Amazon Smart Sticky Note Printer. There are two things to remember. The first thing is, this printer supports only the 2.4GHz Wi-Fi, so make sure your Wi-Fi access point does support the 2.4GHz band. The second thing is, to make the printer work with your Echo, both Echo and the printer has to talk in the same network. So make sure your printer is connected to the same Wi-Fi access point as the Echo does. So let's put paper in. There's an instruction on the bottom to tell you how to put the paper roll properly. So let's power it up. To set up the Wi-Fi of this printer, you do need the Alexa app. So that's uh, the important step you have to remember. So let's go to Alexa app and let's go device, add device, add device, search the category printer it's here and select Amazon. So make sure the Bluetooth of your phone is enabled and go to next and make sure the device, the printer is powered on and the LED now is a solid orange and let's go next. And if you ever store your Wi-Fi credentials in your Amazon account locker and then you don't have to input the password again. Let's wait. So um, this is the list of the uh, Wi-Fi um, SSID that the printer can see. So if you ever store your Wi-Fi credentials in the locker, then you can see this. So when I select this, I don't even need to input the password. So let's, let me just select this. So the printer says, uh, the printer is now connected to your Wi-Fi network. And the, uh, but it's not really finished up yet. So there's an uh, extra step. So the app says, okay, now your printer is connected. Um, let's skip the group selection and this is done. But it's not actually that done. So to make the printer work with the Echo, you actually need to make the, the, the Echo to discover your printer. So there's uh, one more instruction coming out from your printer to tell you how to finish it up. So I have to do this. Alexa, discover my printer. Starting discovery. This will take a few moments. Power on your new devices now, and if needed, put them in pairing mode. To make Echo to discover your printer, it is important the printer is talking to the same Wi-Fi access point as the Echo does. So it will take, uh, take a few minutes to get it. I found Amazon Smart Sticky Note Printer. Now your Echo can talk to your printer. So let's try it. Alexa, print a test page. Your test page was sent to the Amazon printer. So the, uh, this test page content was actually sent from Echo. So, um, so this is how I make an echo work with a printer. But there's another thing you can try. So uh, you can go to App Store to search the app Jotting Up. Jotting Up and install the app. And this is the app you can uh, control your printer. 
So let's open that. Let's get and the couple of permission required to run this app. So this the notification push allow and allow this app to access my photo album and allow my app to access to the, the camera of it. So let's get started. Okay, now this is important to to add the printer to the app. You have to make sure this phone is talking to the same network as the printer does, just like Echo. So I need to uh, go back to Wi-Fi. So it will talk to the same network as the printer does. So then I can add the printer now. So uh, the app requests for the permission to access my local network. I say OK. So search printer and you can see this ID here. So you can add this printer here. Now you can add. So once you add it, um, you can do this. Actually, let's try Budo. So we just saw. Hello. Then let's just open it. So once you have added the printer to the app, you can actually use the app to do the remote printing. Even your phone is going outside. So let's turn off the Wi-Fi. So now the printer is talking to my Wi-Fi, but I will get my phone talking to the 4G network, the carrier network directly. So right now the phone uh, is disconnected from my home Wi-Fi by talking to the carrier network. So let's take the image. So let's take a photo. Let's take a photo. And I'll use this photo. Done. And I can just print it. So now it's doing remote printing. So you can see this photo image is printed remotely. Um, so this is how it works. So hopefully you will enjoy your printer. Have a good day.